Someone gave you a wake-up call recently and you need to release your fear about it. Please scroll on if this doesn't resonate. These are the cards I got. And what I'm getting immediately is <laughs> the wake-up call is causing a lot of fear, anxiety, and frustration. But there's also a peaceful side of this where perhaps it's sent you to, in the right direction. Like, I just feel like there's peace that you're not seeing. That's why you're being told to release the fear. There's an answer to this or it's already over. And I think maybe you're just afraid to believe that it's already over. Let me pull some more cards. So I think the fear is that you're losing some kind of security. Um, that you're, well, really what I was, when I was shuffling, what I got was that you got a wake up call that, I don't know, I feel like maybe you feel threatened in some way. Like someone's trying to replace you and it could be work. I'm supposed to tell you that it's really not the case, but if that's what it's taken to get you out of this situation, then go ahead. Things happen for a reason. Um, basically, what I mean is, I think there's some kind of fear that maybe they're going to get rid of you, but the, honestly, that's not that's just not true. I think that there's just something you bring that is just so different. This I love you. This is someone actively trying to say that to you. Like, I think there's a lot of things that haven't been said. Like, that's held back for reasons beyond my control. I think it actually, you know, if they wanted to say it, they would say it. And it could be romantic. I don't know what it is. But if it's job or some kind of, something like that, you know, something that's not romantic, there could be some legal reason or something why the person has to hold back and can't tell you, like, how great you're doing. But really, it's someone who I think they're going to feel bad that they didn't speak up earlier. I think something happened, maybe miscommunication, or I, I just don't know. But I think you have reason I don't want to say you had reason to be scared because I don't, there should be no fear here, no anxiety, but it's understandable whatever was said or done, it's understandable that you would feel threatened, that your security would feel threatened. But truth be told, it just might be giving you the kick that you need to get out of this. If that's how you feel about it, you know, it, maybe it's made you finally consider other options that you would have never considered and some of those other options are sounding good to you. Go ahead. That's why things happen sometimes, but don't let the fear be what controls you you know like turn that fear into something else ready set go this is a very positive thing like go into your new life your next phase of life the wake-up call is obviously necessary but the anxiety you're feeling i just seriously the anxiety needs to turn to joy of some sort because i think that's what you're you know i shouldn't say it needs to I'm, i think it will i think this new opportunity is on its way or honestly i think it already is here like i said now, I'm not trying to tell you to quit a job or leave something and lack because you ha you think, you you know, this reading's telling you you got something. No, no. Wait till you have it. <laughs> but start visualizing it as and just living in that energy of already having it. That's how we draw it to ourselves. Ooh. Four cards came out for you. I really like that this top one is you deserve to succeed because you do. And you're going to. And I think you feel that your success is threatened. If it's not success, like in a job, it's somewhere else. But you also naturally command respect. You are deceived by no one and you attract healthy relationships. This pretty much always means that whatever's going on here isn't healthy and it's time for you to attract it. You need to dwell in that. Find those people who actually want your success, you know, those people who don't feel threatened by your success. Because I think that could be what caused the miscommunication. Because even though you aren't threatened, like you feel that way, understandably, it's somebody could be that somebody they're trying to deceive you or they are jealous of you jealous of the respect that you get so they were trying to knock you down a peg or whatever you know um but anyway you are deceived by no one and you're going to be out of this you just need to release your fear nothing no one can take away what's meant for you you are deceived by no one and you naturally command respect it is spoken it is written and so it is amen